a life divine with no religion. This is the message brought to us by the Matri Mandir. A Sanskrit word which means the temple of the mother, Matri Mandir is a symbol of human solidarity in pursuit of peace and unity. In this episode of Philippine Tales, allow me to take you on a journey to discover Matri Mandir and understand the significance of this beautiful structure. Matri Mandir is located right in the center of Oroville, a universal town in the Bilipuram district of Tamil Nadu. The best way to access the place is through the East Coast Road or State Highway No. 49. The road took us to village homes interspersed by eclectic shops selling various products and offering several services. On the road, Aurobillians can be seen traveling on foot or on their motorbikes or bicycles. Signs leading to Auroville are visible in every corner. A well-planned parking area is provided for all the guests. A five-minute walk amidst greeneries featuring beautiful flora and fauna led us to the visitor center. Here, before obtaining a pass to visit the Matri Mandir, an informative and educational photo exhibition tells the story of Auroville and how it came about. The concept of Auroville, an ideal township devoted to an experiment in human unity, came to the mother as early as the 1930s. It was brought forth to the government of India in the mid-1960s. In 1996, UNESCO passed a unanimous resolution commending it as a project of importance to the future of humanity. Some 5,000 people assembled near the banyan tree at the center of the future township for an inauguration ceremony on February 28, 1968. The event was attended by representatives of 124 nations and all the states of India. These representatives brought with them some soil from their homeland to be mixed in a white marble-clad lotus-shaped urn now sited at the focal point of the amphitheater. To further deepen our knowledge, we had to watch a video presentation to understand more about the Matri Mandir, what the place is all about, how it was built, and its significance in the modern world. After obtaining the pass, we had to take a shaded 10 to 12 minute walk from the visitor center to the viewing point. A free electric shuttle service is available for those who may find it difficult to walk the approximately one kilometer distance each way. Welcoming the visitors to the Matri Mandir is an imposing banyan tree. History tells us that by late 1965, when the time had come to define the center of Auroville, Roger Anger, the French architect to whom the mother had asked to design the future town, brought a map of the area to the mother sitting in her room in the ashram. Deciding on the area to be called heart of the community, she pointed to a particular area on the map, which turned out to be where a solitary banyan tree in an almost barren plateau is located. Delighted by the presence of the tree, regarded as sacred in India, the mother decided to make it Aurobill's geographical center. Local and international tourists flock to see the stately edifice and are enchanted by mother's vision for it, the story of how it was conceived and how it came about. A few meters more and we reached the Matri Mandir viewing point, a raised garden area which offered visitors a beautiful view of the Matri Mandir and its surroundings. Standing right in the middle is the majestic Matri Mandir. The Matri Mandir is a great spiritual edifice for the practitioner of integral yoga. It is at the center of Auroville and is built by the mother of the Aurobindo ashram in the center of the town called... Looking back after such a wonderful experience gave us a more positive view of life 
and of the future ahead of us.